Welcome, and let's take a look at Virginia Computer Science Standards. The state of Virginia, like many states, had adopted their computer science standards from CSTA in a very similar fashion. As such, their standards align very closely to Rex Academy. So in 2017, their Board of Education adopted these standards for all their students. Within these standards were three fun or four fundamental principles that they want taught. Computer literacy, or essentially how students can use technology with high efficiency. This means things like performing research and, and finding information on the internet. Educational technology, meaning students can apply computer literacy to school subjects. Once again, that'll simply mean uh, pulling up a uh, using computer science to perform a project in school. Digital citizenship, meaning they understand the appropriate use of technology and use it responsibly. So this can mean things like making sure that they're not committing plagiarism or copyright violations. And finally, information technology, so where students learn industrial applications of computer science, or in other words, they do some hands-on activities that give them a just a slice of how the pros do it at the very top, right? In addition, Virginia is attempting to improve the following areas. Computational thinking, creating a collaborative, inclusive environment for students, and ultimately reducing the equity issues that surround computer science education. All of this matches Rex Academy quite well, and therefore, at Rex, we indeed have matched Virginia's vision with our own. Here are the state requirements. As of right now, the State Board of Education in Virginia is mandating that the K-12 through learning standards should be implemented in all schools. However, they are not at a point where all high schools in Virginia can necessarily offer computer science. In those districts that do have it, computer science credits can count towards math, laboratory science, or CT courses. Obviously, it'll be very specific courses, not necessarily all of them. In addition, computer science may also count as foreign language requirements for graduation. Now, for teaching, a teacher with existing license, meaning they already have a teacher's license in some other field, can obtain a computer science endorsement by passing the Praxis computer science exam. Once again, if you are following any of these states, you know that this is very common since the Praxis exam is a is a really good uh, measuring stick for uh, uh, early level computer science knowledge. So it's used widely and therefore it's excellent for teacher training. Um, Virginia also aligns to CSTA and IST standards. We've already kind of talked about this. This very closely mirrors the five standards for uh, uh, CSTA. Um, Virginia creates cybersecurity on its own. So they, they want that as a standalone course. And therefore, uh, its standards were partly pushed by an organization called Code VA. So this is a nonprofit uh, program in Virginia that advocates for computer science education in the K-12 space. When you look at Virginia's standards and what they've written, they've, they've actually gone quite in depth uh, standardizing and specifying specific standards for every level not only the standard of learning, but also the curriculum framework. If you'll notice at the very end, they've got three big classes at the high school level that they want taught, computer science foundation, computer science principles. That sounds very much like the APCS principles. And then computer science programming, similar to the APCSA class, although they do have some additional standards that do not align necessarily with the APCSA class. And then the rest can also be accessed here. They have both the standards and the framework in PDF format. Therefore, Rex Academy is proud to announce that we are well aligned to Virginia uh, standards. This is high school. This is middle school. And of course, this is elementary. And as such, we've created some pathways, as always, to recommend uh, to these districts in Virginia. Right, and as we uh, get through these pathways, Rex Academy is also able to recommend some certifications 
as you can see right here. All right, that's it.